Good job. Thanks. Here you go, Barney. A special spot just for you. Did you see our castle? See it? How could I miss it? Well, it looks like you're getting some practice in, though. I am. Thanks to Danny. Playing catch is fun. It looks like fun. May I play? Of course. Here, Barney, catch. It's a great day. A beautiful day. The kind of day that makes me want to say, I'm glad that I'm alive. I'm happy to be me. And that's the way to be. See how the clouds go drifting by. See how the sun lights up the sky. On a day like this, summer, winter, fall, or spring, it makes me want to sing. It's a great day, a beautiful day. The kind of day that makes me want to say, I'm glad that I'm alive, I'm happy to be me, and that's the way to be. See all the colors of the world, see all your friends, each boy and girl, on a day like this, when it's great to work or play, it makes me want to say, it's a great day, a beautiful day. The kind of day that makes me want to say, I'm glad that I'm alive, I'm happy to be me, and that's the way to be. to go someplace, like on a vacation trip. Oh, that's right. We better get these pastels. Yeah, Sorry about that. Don't worry. Oh, yeah, that's a lot of them. Oh, okay, there we go. Did we find all the posters? I think a couple rolled over there. Look, they sure did. But we found them. <laughs> Where did all these posters come from, anyway? Miss Chris came to our school today, and she brought posters for everybody. She's a travel agent. Yeah. Oh, uh, what's a travel agent? Well, a travel agent is someone who shows people fun places they can visit. Oh! And a travel agent helps people choose how to go places, like riding on an airplane, a ship, a bus, or a train. Oh, I'd like to do that. Yeah. Oh, there sure are a lot of posters. Do you think they're all different? Mm. Well, let's hang them up and see. Okay. okay. Yeah. Yeah. I wonder what's on this. Wow, that's a Check it out. Yeah, there really are lots of places. I wanted to be Baby Bob. Mm -hmm. I was just feeling kind of mad inside. Mm -hmm. That's okay, BJ. I was feeling kind of mad today, too. You were? How come? Well, I wanted a new bike like Keisha's. Yeah, and I was feeling sad today because my poster didn't win a ribbon like Jeff's did. Really? I was wishing I could be a school safety helper, like Kristen. No kidding. And I was feeling bad because I can't throw a football the way Steven does. Well, it's like I said, sometimes everybody wants things they don't have. And if that makes you a little bit mad or a little bit sad, you're just like everyone else. I should think it'd be fun to be a baseball player. When you grow up, you can be anything you want to be. When I grow up, I'd like to be a nurse, but I wonder if I'll know how. I guess I'll just keep learning things a little at a time, and I think I'll start right now. Because we learn big things a little at a time. To go right up a mountain, first we learn to climb. I can be anything when I grow up by learning a little at a time. When I grow up, I'd like to ride a horse, but I wonder if I'll know how. I guess I'll just keep learning things a little at a time, and I think I'll start right now. Because we learn big things a little at a time, to go right up 
a mountain, first we learn to climb. I could be anything when I grow up, by learning a little at a time. Well, but you see it. When I grow up, I'd like to play baseball, but I wonder if I'll know how. I guess I'll just keep learning things a little at a time, and I think I'll start right now.
Always be a baby bump. <laughs> Everybody's doing a terrific job. I like those buttons, they're so shiny. Oh, I like yours. Oh, that looks really neat. Wow. It looks like a little hard work really pays off. All finished. Number two. I made a number two. <laughs> I have two eyes and two hands, and I have two feet for hopping, hopping. <laughs>
just me. <laughs> now these pants, coat, and gloves help protect us from the heat. These are very special heavy boots. If we step on something hot, they'll protect our feet. May I try on the coat? Sure. Oh, wow. You've almost disappeared. Boy, this is heavy. Well, that's so it can better protect us. Now, who knows the most important rule to remember if you're ever in a house or building that catches fire? Get out and stay out. That's absolutely right. And you should know how to leave a building that's filled with smoke. You crawl under the smoke to find your way out. Come on, let's practice. Okay. Yeah. yeah. That's the way. Another important rule is, if you find matches or a lighter, tell a grown-up. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Does anyone know what this is? It's a smoke alarm. That's right. How many of you have smoke alarms in your house? Oh, yeah, I do. Very good. Every house should have smoke alarms. Oh, that's right, Kim. They make a loud sound that lets you know when there's smoke and fire. This one sounds like this. Oh, oh. <laughs> You know, I'm going to be a firefighter when I grow up. Good for you. And so am I. Great. <laughs> I can't wait. When I grow up, I know what I want to be. A firefighter. That's me. I'll put fires out quick as can be. Well, I'm not a firefighter. Come on, Robert. Just a baby living in Africa. Hey, that's a good clue. The animal comes from Africa. But how are we going to find out which animals at the zoo come from Africa? Well, why don't we find out with... The Adventure Screen! <laughs> a zoo is a place where animals from many different places come together and live. The animals come from all over the world. Here are some animals that come from Africa. Oh, look. A zebra comes from Africa. Its black and white stripes are so pretty. That's a hippopotamus. I learned in school that a hippo loves the water and is an excellent swimmer. That's right. Hippos spend most of their days in water. 
And those are called gazelles. They live in big groups and can run very fast. They're pretty. Maybe Stella's present goes to a gazelle. Hmm. That's a giraffe. Uh -huh. They're the ones with long necks. That's right. Their long necks help them reach the leaves at the very tip top of trees. Wow, a lot of cool animals come from Africa. That's right, Robert. And the zoo is a great place to see them. <laughs> so, do you think you know which animal Stella's present goes to? Well, I think we're getting closer. <laughs> now we know that the present goes to an animal at the zoo. <laughs> Hey, everybody. Oh, thanks for the train ride. You're welcome, Barney. We're glad you're here, Barney. Now we'll have an absolutely, positively happy day. Oh. <laughs> Count me in on that plan. <laughs> so, everybody wants to have a super d duper day, huh? Yes. Oh, this will be so much fun. Our day will be just like a puzzle. A puzzle? What do you mean, Barney? Well, each of the fun things we'll do today will be like a different piece of a puzzle. And just maybe we'll put together a real puzzle along the way. A real puzzle? <laughs> All right, let's get started. Okay, then, everybody, line up. Hey. <laughs> let's have everyone suggest fun things to do to make the day extra special. BJ can go first. All right. Keisha second. Curtis third. Robert fourth and Kim fifth. We'll take turns. <laughs> oh, we take turns. Oh, we take turns. So we'll all have fun. So we'll all have fun. And we include. And we include. Everyone. Everyone. Oh, oh we take turns. So we'll all have fun. And we include. Everyone. Oh, we take turns. So we'll all have fun. something else. It's Robert's turn to pick. Uh, that was so cool. I can see my house. I like going through the clouds and seeing the birds. That was the best. Thank you, Barney. Oh, you're very welcome, Ashley. And thank you for having such a super deep super idea. <laughs> Boy, I can't wait to tell Baby Bop about all the great stuff we did today. In fact, I'm not gonna wait. I'll tell her right now. I'll see you later, guys. There's one more thing I like to do with it. Certainly did a good job helping Mr. Boyd pick a color for the wall. And we had lots of fun with all the colors, too. Uh -huh. And your hat was really special, Barney. Oh, it sure was, but not as special as having friends like you. <laughs> I love you. You love me. We're a happy family.
Me too. Let's not forget the gifts we made for our grandparents. Oh, yeah.